I'm Rebecca Cook. I am an associate professor of cell and developmental biology in the School of Medicine at Vanderbilt. I have an associate's appointment in the Department of Biomedical Engineering at the School of Engineering. Part of my research is understanding how the breast normally develops and how protein signaling pathways that are involved in breast development get commandeered by cancers um, and how we can use that information to treat breast cancers. We're also looking at the tumor microenvironment of breast cancers and understanding how the immune system plays a role in the development of cancers and how we can target the immune system and we train the immune system to attack cancer cells. I came into breast cancer research when I came to Vanderbilt and started my training with Carlos Santiago, who's a, a world-renowned breast cancer clinician scientist. And under his training, uh, I was really able to expand the idea that, um, that these signaling processes that control development in the breast are used by cancers, and we can target those specifically to treat the breast cancers with with really great specificity and with very little collateral damage to the rest of the body. That journey became much more personal when my, uh, my husband's mother, who I had really just adopted as my own, my own mother, um, she was battling breast cancer for, for nearly almost 23 years before she lost that battle. And watching her in the final years of that battle the, the grace that she conducted herself with and the strength that she had and the support that she gave me for what I was doing really inspired me to carry on that research uh, after she passed. So one of the um, greatest parts about my job is that I train young scientists who are undergraduate students or graduate students or postdoctoral fellows. Um, and I train them in this specific field of research. And, and then they carry that training on to their future careers. I am strictly basic science, but I have a very translational angle on it. Um, my science, my, my research has been moved into clinical trials. But at that point, I, I generally become hands-off with it and, and wait to, you know, I just and eagerly anticipate the results of the clinical trial. Basic science is critical for what I do. These are the, um, these are asking and answering the questions that lie at, at the core of improving outcomes for patients with breast cancer. These are going to help us uh, understand why breast cancers occur. And if we can figure that out, then maybe one day we can prevent breast cancers. These are going, these basic science questions are going to be able to help us detect breast cancers much earlier, which is also going to save lives. And these basic science questions and their answers are going to find cures that right now don't exist.